Hey everyone, it's me, Apple, and with me is uh, FDA. And we're starting a new segment. Uh, I'm, I seem to be making a lot of new segments for Command and Cotometary. It's just like a cheap knockout for the lack of playthroughs lately. But there's a new segment called uh, <laughs> Top 10. And the topic today is uh, Top 10 Bosses. Uh, it could be hardest boss, uh, annoying boss, anything. And it's all up to FTA. It's FTA, Top 10 Bosses. Yeah, I, this is like top um, 10 hardest. And it, it, this isn't necessarily, well not all of them are, but this isn't necessarily the bosses I still find hard today. This is like just if I had to, in terms of my years of gaming, the ones that probably gave me the, the most trouble. This is um, my list, and it's not really in complete order, but number one is the boss that will haunt me to my grave, just that son of a bitch. Is that... Well, the, well look, I'll start... You want to start right? from we'll 10 to up? First, okay, let's start at 10. Of course, you don't, you don't reveal your biggest one first, you Well, friend. then don't make it sound like you're going to. <laughs> no, but I'm just... Oh, jeez, you suck so much, Apple. God, FCA. You're, you're, the, you're, you're, top, so much better you're than the reason why I support, like, you know, protected sex. What? Child abortion? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Have your child abortion. He might turn out like me. <laughs> oh, my goodness. You know, happy, th my parents have been ha happy... Happy Thanksgiving, parents everyone. <laughs> My parents have been saying the same thing for years. <laughs> Never stopped you, you were a fighter. <laughs> <laughs> nope, I broke through the country. <laughs> so let's, let's see, start um, at number 10. <laughs> number 10 would probably be, um, start with, with a classic game, Death Deck from Sonic 2. Oh, wow. Yeah. Just, just, in, the, in really kind of that level, because of course first you have to, um, fight, you know, fucking Silver Sonic, and of course nowadays, you know, his, it's all about, you know, as a, as a pattern, and to be fair, the, the Silver Sonic pattern is pretty, of, you know, it's easy now, once you, no, nah, but back then, just, oh, Jesus Christ, and, and then you defeat him, and there's that laughable bit where, where Robotnik runs faster than Sonic, which just makes no sense, <laughs> then he jumps into that fucking machine, ah, oh, just, no, you fat robotic Bastard. It was fucking epic. I remember that from Sonic 2, right? It was. Yeah, yeah. So, so, so I think it just the it took me like I, I finished Sonic 1 and Sonic 3 separately, but like the both of them took me three days to finish, and I wasn't even playing like you know constantly. But like three days, I finished both games. It took me over a year to finish Sonic 2. Oh my goodness! I just I remember know. playing that game religiously. It was that was the first. That was the second console I ever got was, was Mega Drive Sonic 2. <laughs> Uh, number nine would have to be a uh, Quick Man from Mega Man 2. Oh, of course. And, now, uh, and when I say Quick Man, I don't mean like him in general. I mean like if you go to him first, you're a fucking moron. This is virtually impossible. Unless you have, I, I forget which power up kills him easy easiest. It's yeah, you know, it, it's probably Metal Blade because Metal Blade was just a kick-ass weapon. But yeah, just. Going to the quick man first is just like, you know, it's suicidal, mate. You can't be done. He's, he's too quick for you. Oh, man. So, <laughs> uh, number eight isn't technically a boss, it's just a villain, which is just. Admittedly, upon reflection, I would have to go back and probably. Eight should be, should be number one because I haven't actually defeated this one. But, um. <laughs> any. Any member of the Zoa from Sonic Chronicles The Dark Brotherhood, no matter what move you throw at them, it only does 1% damage. Other. And they, their health bar is like over 400, so you're like doping all your fucking like power moves with one. You can't, you know, unless you have the ability to just reheal for 6 hours, you won't ever be able to defeat them. Which How do they expect you to lose the win against that? You can't, you have to run again, you have to run, run oh. around. And essentially, seeing as the last, the final fight is done in like 10 seconds, kind of a piss poor judgment, to be honest. <laughs> Never played Sonic Chronicles. I have no intentions to. It's you know, I would say I would say it's a bad game. It's an average, it's an average game, nothing more. You know, I think it, it it could be an awesome game, but the sequel would have to improve on a lot of things. It's a good way to start. Yeah, 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 yeah it's, it's it's not a bad way to start, you know. I, I wouldn't say it's a terrible yeah. game. It's not. An it's just building game. the grounds for what could be a better sequel. Um, seven is um, Carnage from the Mega Drive game <laughs> Maximum Carnage. <laughs> it's the the Spider-Man and Venom beat him up. When you, <laughs> you get you fight him like four times at the game, and every time he just wipes the, the floor with you. Seriously. 